Setting up indents in Google Docs is super easy, and there's a few ways you can do it. This video will show you how. I have a document open with some random text that I want to add indentation to. The quickest, probably the easiest method is to use the blue margin arrows at the top of the page. If you click the downward facing arrow on the left side and drag it to the right, you'll see an indentation happen for the paragraph where your cursor currently is. In this case, the entire paragraph is indented. Notice that the arrow and the line above it both moved. Let's undo that to set the arrow back to where it was. If you want only the first line of the paragraph to be indented, click and drag the line above the arrow. And you'll see that only the first sentence is indented. Let's undo that again. Now what if you want to do this for all of your paragraphs? To do that, just highlight all of the paragraphs you want to have indented and drag the triangle or the line to the right. Now all the paragraphs are indented. Not only that, if I hit the enter key, we can see that the new paragraphs will also keep this indentation. Now let's talk about another type of indentation called a hanging indent, which is essentially the opposite of indenting the first sentence. A hanging indent will indent everything but the first sentence. This is commonly used in bibliographies. To do a hanging indent, you can highlight the paragraph you want to indent, drag the arrow to the right, then drag the line above the arrow back over to the left, and the selected paragraph will now have a hanging indent. That's how you can indent using the margin arrows. Another way, which can give you a bit more precise control, is to use the toolbar and menu options. Let's set everything back to how it was when we started. Okay, now I'll highlight some paragraphs. In the toolbar, there are a couple of icons for increasing and decreasing the indent. If I click on increase, we will see the paragraphs move to the right. Decrease will do the opposite. We can also go to the menu and click on Format, then Align and Indent, and we'll see the same increase and decrease options as the toolbar. But at the bottom of this menu, we can see the indentation options. This is where you get precise control over your indentations. You can enter specific left and right values which will apply to the entire paragraph. Or you can click on the special drop down and set a specific value for the first line or hanging indents. Click on apply and you will see your changes applied to the selected paragraphs. And that's it. Now you know all the ways you can set indents in Google Docs. I hope you found this video to be helpful. If you did, click on the like button or share it with somebody else who might like it. Maybe even consider subscribing to the channel. I'll see you in another video.